So one aspect when people handle the claims themselves that they fail to do or know to do, that's important, is make sure your contractor is adding in 20% for overhead and profit. This is going to be a short video. My name is Mike Keeler. I'm a licensed public adjuster in Florida, here to guide people, help people, and educate people on the homeowner's insurance claim process, give you some tips, has anything to do with, and you'll find several videos that I have on roof claims, water damage claims, fire claims, you name it, I've probably got a video on it. So, if you hire your own contractor, as most of you probably will, then they'll write their own estimate and more than likely you will submit that to the insurance company for their consideration, okay? When they write their estimate, whatever contractor it is, always make sure there's an additional 20% for overhead and profit, okay? Whatever they write it for, if they put drywall, 5,000, painting, 2,000, total, 7,000 include 20% overhead and profit. Okay, on top of that. So you always want to add this because we're going to tell you the reasons why. So the insurance companies allow it. It's part of actually even this larger program, which we're going to talk about that everybody uses to evaluate and kind of give the best idea of what your damages are. So this is why you want to do it because it'll give you an opportunity to negotiate from a higher amount. So you're going to get and allow a greater flexibility because the insurance company estimates are 99.9% .9 inaccurate and intentionally lower. You're going to find that. So if that's intentionally lower, guess what? The 20% overhead profit is lower as well. So the program used, which is extremely flawed, some will say, no, it's not. It's accurate. It's pretty, it's called Xactimate. Okay. Now, it's not too far off and if they do regional pricing so they'll do drywall baseboards anything that you can imagine exactimate has a price for where it falls terribly short at is floors labor okay cabinets roofs fencing um pool cages we have a lot of that in florida all right so there's a lot of things that's normally the big ticket items where Xactimate falls short. If you have anything custom, forget about it. Xactimate is not even going to come close. So you know, others will say, no, it's within a ballpark and that's fine. So again, you want to be able to have the ability to negotiate from a higher amount that 20% gives you that. All right. And because of the flaws, in Xactimate, the prices will not be accurate as to what your contractor may charge. So Xactimate, let me give you a brief rundown of the history. Xactimate was created and formed by an insurance company. Somebody who worked for the insurance company. And they did it so that it creates line items. Literally, you could put screws on there, door handles for a buck. It doesn't the, they want to see every line item and everything that goes into it. Why? Because they could take it out and say, wait a minute, that's not damage. That's fine. You don't need to do that. You don't need to do this. You don't need to replace that. So that's why they want it. They don't want to see your contractor's estimate. They want everything to be done through Xactimate so they could take everything out. And guess what? Now you're paid lower. So um, don't fall for it. Always add in the 20%. It's very important. So again, my name is Mike Keel. I'm a licensed public adjuster in the state of Florida. If you have a question, need help with the claim, here's my contact information on how you can get a hold of me. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up and a like. Subscribe to the channel.